incidentally, there is one ride that most of the expected 12 million visitors here will be sure to take because it's the only one that gives not only a great look at the fair, but also a panoramic view of New Orleans. Welcome to the gondolas over the Mississippi River, a four and a half minute ride that leaves you two choices on the other side. Buy another ticket to get back to the fair or swim to your car. This evening, your tour guides are Dolores and Bob Peterson of Denville, New Jersey. Uh, are you as frightened of this thing as I am? Uh... Yes, <laughs> I am. Especially since it's the first day. Yes, I am. We kind of watched it all day to find until uh, we saw a short line and then uh, jumped in. We waited till later in the day in case anybody was going to crash. <laughs> Halfway across, and one of our guides finally gets the courage to look out. I think it's visually a lovely fair. We have seen about, I would say, two-thirds of it by now, and we're hoping to see the rest of it. We'll the view may be OK, but you notice that this part is like looking down from a 600-yard diving board. We're going downhill now, yes. And it's very nice, and it's a smooth ride. Actually, the most striking thing about the gondola ride is that it's over very fast. Of course, there is the return trip, but Wayne Powell thought about renting a boat. This one fellow was an insurance agent, so I didn't really take a policy, but he almost had me talked into an insurance policy on the way back. Want to try it? You've got six months until the fair closes or until tomorrow night to ride with the Petersons. That's when they go back to Denville. At the World's Fair, about 600 yards up, Tim Minton, News 4.